Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to make a simple line chart. Uh, just like the column chart series of videos I made, which you should check out on my channel, I split that into three parts and I'm going to try to do the same here. Um, if not three, definitely two parts. And the first part, which is this video, I'm going to focus on the very foundation using a very basic example uh, of when to use a, uh, when it's appropriate to use a line chart and how to build a line chart okay so let's just jump right into it here we got I, I made some data that would lend itself to our example here we have uh, the closing price of a particular stock and and these are the months that we recorded the closing price so we have a year of closing prices and in, in any case where you're dealing with time, usually a line chart is a great uh, tool to use to visualize the, uh, the ebbs and flows, the ups and downs of uh, the particular thing you're looking for, which in our case is the stock price. Okay, so we can first of all, like I showed in the other video on column and bar charts, we can just simply highlight the entire table, go to insert, line and create and click on line chart and Excel will will make 90% of what we need for us okay we may not need a legend here because we only have one line one series uh, to use Excel's lingo um, we might want to tweak the title we may want to format this axis to show dollar signs but besides that it did a really good job now this is all fine and well and we could just be done here but what I want to show you is how to build this uh, in, from, the, from scratch without uh, simply uh, depending on Excel to uh, do this for you. Because when you get to slightly more complicated examples, um, it becomes uh, necessary for you to be able to go a little bit in the back end and uh, tweak stuff. So let's build the same thing from scratch. <coughs> now click anywhere on the screen so the table is not highlighted and go to the same place insert line choose the line chart and you see we get a blank slate to start with now whenever you uh, want to build a chart the first thing you want to do is give Excel the data and the way you do that is under the chart tools here under the design tab choose select data okay this is where the chart is made right here this is where you feed Excel what the, the numbers and the labels that it needs to populate a chart whatever chart type you might have chosen in this case we're obviously doing a line chart okay so the first thing you want to do is you want to come here on the left and add a series this is where the actual numbers will go so click add and then first you want to give a series name and our series name is going to be this our series is going to be this column so the series name is the header of that column the series values are the values under that header and you see already in the background that Excel is populating our chart click OK and the second thing you want to do here this only other thing you can do here is to edit the horizontal axis labels as you can see here Excel by default chooses the numbers 1 up to the number of data points that you have in our case we have 12 months so it just did 1 to 12 but we don't want 1 to 12 here we want the actual months on that axis so the way we adjust that is we go over here click on edit and we just simply highlight the months and not taking in the header okay click OK and you could see in the background that Excel has populated that axis and now we're done with this select source data dialog box click OK and now we're back to where Excel had started us with before when we did it the easy way and so here we can make some tweaks again we don't need a legend because we only have one uh, the data series or line <coughs> we may want to tweak this title I'll just type 2012 but you could type anything you want here another thing maybe we want to do is maybe have these uh, this y-axis formatted as a uh, currency instead of just numbers you may not want this but maybe just a little added uh, lesson here you can right click on the axis go to format axis 
and then you have all these options here that you can tweak your axes okay the way you change the formatting on it the the actual to, to currency is you click on number and then over here just like formatting uh, the contents of any cell choose currency and I would say zero decimal places you don't want it to be uh, too much uh, too, we don't need those uh, zero cents so just click close and click off that and voila we got our chart it's the same chart that Excel created except we did some uh, tweaks to it and it, except that this time we actually built it from the ground up starting with an empty slate okay so this uh, is a good foundation for creating any chart and specifically creating a line chart so I hope this example is illustrated when you'd want to use a line chart over a bar chart, over a pie chart, and, and the other types of charts uh, available to you in Excel. Um, and also, I hope it was uh, pretty clear on how to create it from the ground up and uh, how to make some minor tweaks. In the next video I'm going to do in this uh, two or three part series on line charts, I'll show a more complicated example with perhaps uh, multiple stocks all shown on one chart and I'll show you how to input that and how to uh, how to build that chart uh, using the same uh, techniques we learned here except uh, just just taking it one step further so hope this was helpful make sure you comment subscribe to my channel check out the other videos on my channel uh, like me favorite and also uh, let me know if there's any other videos you'd like me to do, any other tutorials. Till next time, practice, 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 and have a great day.